Today is Good Friday, and welcome to the Daily Dose. It's always a sobering day. It's that day where we remember that Jesus Christ, the one who spoke all of creation into existence, the one who upholds the universe by the word of his power, the one who came and dwelt among us and showed us what the kingdom of God was like. He calmed storms and he fed multitudes and he raised the dead and he healed the sick, gave sight to the blind, and he spoke with authority that was different than anyone else. And the Lord of life on that Friday afternoon was crucified. Why'd he do it? Why in the world would we call this good Friday. Well, 1 Peter 3.18 gives us an explanation. Here's what Peter, Jesus' good friend, the one who was filled with courage after Jesus rose from the dead, here's how he reflects years later on the death of Christ. He says this, For Christ also suffered for sins, the righteous for the unrighteous, that he might bring us to God. What a simple and beautiful Gospel in a nutshell, explanation. What is this Good Friday all about? It's that Christ died for sins, the righteous for the unrighteous, to bring us to God. Have you been brought to God? Have you put your hope in Jesus? He died on the cross so that you wouldn't have to die. So that you, even though you're unrighteous, just like I'm unrighteous, could be brought to God. We were cut off from him because of sin. We were separated from God because of our rebellion. We had turned our backs on the Lord of life. And in his mercy, he died for us to bring us to God. There's no truth more important in the world than that. There's nothing more appropriate to celebrate than that. Happy Good Friday.